الله الرحمن الرحیم My dear brothers, sisters, friends and colleagues at Soleimaniya Polytechnic University, Kurdistan, Iraq Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah My name is Amir Hussein Takyan I am professor at the chair of the Department of Global Health and Public Policy at the School of Public Health, Tehran University of Medical Sciences in Tehran the capital of Islamic Republic of Iran it's my great honor and pleasure to address you during the inauguration ceremony of the fourth international conference on public health and medical sciences to be held by you on 19 of October 2020. I had the privilege to attend the third international conference in July 2019 and I traveled to Kurdistan. I visited Erbil and Soleimani and other cities in Kurdistan and I enjoyed the friendship, the beauty of your country and the depth and the joy that you are living with in this beautiful country. It's a pity that because of the COVID-19, I cannot travel this time, despite the warm invitation I received from my colleagues, Dr. Muhammad Abu Bak, Dr. Salar Ali, and other colleagues from Kurdistan. COVID-19 is changing our life in a dramatic ways. We need to remember that health is the precondition, the pillar, and the outcome of sustainable societies. When sustainable development goals were built and approved by the United Nations back in 2015, five Ps were made and accepted as the pillars of sustainable development. They are peace, prosperity, planet, people, and last but not least, partnership. Partnership is the key to address the challenges of the complex life that we're living in. COVID-19 has changed our life in dramatic ways, in all aspects that we can remember. And this is going to bring a new normal, a new standard of living for years to come. Many people across the globe are working together in order to address the challenges of global health because of COVID-19 and other things. The reason that we are working together is because of fostering and expanding our partnership for the better public health of our population. TOMS, Tehran University of Medical Sciences, with over 180 years of prosperous existence, has been the key for advancing medical sciences and public health in the country, the region, and globally. We are very proud to work with you in Soleimaniya Polytechnic University and all colleagues in Kurdistan, Iraq, in order to advance the sciences, in order to do good research, education, and work together to bring better popu uh, population health for our people. The challenges of global health cannot be addressed by one person, two person, one country, or one continent. Partnership is the key to overcome the battle of the challenges. While we are experiencing these challenges, it's important to work together to do this. I think the fourth international conference, which is about research and better research for quality, held by you on 19 of October 2020, is a great opportunity to share the experiences and learn from each other and build more collaborations and partnership. At TOMS, we are with you, you're standing with you, and we will be working with you in this very strategic collaboration in order to make this happen. I wish this conference bring better opportunities for collaboration, and I wish you a very healthy and successful and good conference. And I look forward to seeing all of you in person in near future in order to improve our collaboration in better ways. Thank you very much for giving us the opportunity. And I wish you all the best, health and success. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Khuda hafiz. in the research field for 18 years and during this time I have had the opportunity to participate and present my research results in many international conferences. In today's fast-changing world, attending a conference has become a must for a scientist in order to find out what's new in a certain field of study, to discuss critically, to socialize and to know new colleagues. Among the congresses that I have attended related to public health and medical sciences, 
I was very impressed with the conference on the health and medical sciences held at the Suleimani Polytechnic University. I've been collaborating with this conference for four years and I've appreciated the work for the organization and engagement of the conference. Very interesting and stimulating for me in terms of the content, a perfect mix of interesting and high quality abstracts that I've had the pleasure to review, topics, talks, nice participants, all this in the wonderful location of Kurdistan. I would like to thank the president of the Suleimani Polytechnic University, Professor Dr. Alan Feridun and the Professor Dr. Mohamed Babakir Mina, Dean of the Technical College of Health, for the amazing conference and for all your efforts you made it happen. Due to the coronavirus pandemia, I'm unfortunately not able to attend the next conference, but I'm looking forward to joining the next editions and strengthen our successful collaboration. All the best for the fourth international conference. This is Yusuf Ausaj. Um, thank you very much uh, for you guys to invite me again to your fourth International Health uh, Conference. Um, it's a great honor to, to give this talk and, and see you again. It would be great to be there in Soleimani to participate in uh, your great events. That would be a very uh, good privilege. Um, but unfortunately, due to the current restriction, uh, unfortunately, I won't be maybe I won't be able to do that. Um, as it's uh, very restricted here, and it's very busy as well, as you know, due to this uh, very fine time of our life, where COVID is hitting everywhere. Um, and uh, I have just to, if I uh, travel, I have to rest, like isolate for two weeks, which is, I can't afford it because it's too busy here. Um, but I, I find the privilege to send you this um, video to say hello for uh, number one and to congra congratulate you guys um, for making the uh, conference for this fourth successive year. And I'm, I'm sure it will be very great and successful uh, meeting and I was really hoping to uh, join you guys and uh, uh, exchange the experience and and how we all react to this um, and what's the best way of uh, protecting ourselves and our beloved one. Um, I'd like to thank SPU for their great honour um, keep, by keeping inviting me even if these very uh, difficult times. I'd like specifically to thank uh, Dr. Freydun, Dr. Mohammed, and Dr. Salah and congratulate them as well for their great efforts um, to grow people and uh, pursue this big meeting um, to uh, exchange the experience and uh, uh, enjoy this big uh, scientific events um, which is not easy in this difficult time to group um, in and um, I, I would like to hope for all of you uh, to have a great time at the